Unsurprisingly, Susan Phil met in the pub. Filthy McNasties, which is just as classy as it sounds. <laughs> Phil bought Sue's a drink. They got talking about their mutual love for travel. Sue's had been home from backpacking for around six months and had recently booked her next adventure, a four day hike along the Inca Trail to the Machu Picchu in Peru. Phil was very jealous and joked that he was going to book the same trip and join her on her travels. The night almost ended there, with Sue saying she would only give Phil her number if he could remember her name. Which he could not. <laughs> Six months later, Susan Phil trekked to the Inca Trail together. And after four days spent constantly in each other's company with no showers or proper toilet facilities, they were still together and still fancied each other. What you gonna do to go and rise above? Don't sit down, keep moving on, yeah. You can do anything that you want. to Mrs. Suzanne Clark. My soulmate and partner in crime, she looks more beautiful than I ever could have imagined. Thank you for agreeing to marry me. Thank you for your passion in making this the most magical day. We need each other. We drive each other crazy. We are rubbish when we're not together. And I'm excited to have a wonderful day and night here with all our friends. Then I'm excited to get home and settle into married life together. And who knows, hopefully in a couple of years, we might hear the pattern of tiny feet. Who am I kidding? In April, we had the most wonderful spanner thrown into the works of our wedding planning, that we will have a baby by Christmas. We are so excited and terrified at the same time. So on that lovely note, it just remains for me to say that on behalf of my wife and I, I'd like to raise a toast to life, love and happiness. Thank you everybody. Talking,